Today we are going to review a YouTube channel that's doing four things really well and there's four areas where they could also improve. We're going to combine those together to give you guys eight ideas for how you can grow and improve your own YouTube channel based on what we're going to learn from this channel we're going to review here today. Hey guys, my name is Tim Schmoyer and welcome to Video Creators, the channel that is all about helping you grow your YouTube audience so that you can spread a message that changes people's lives. And in this series, in channel reviews, we take a look at a YouTube channel that has 1,000 subscribers or less that is also spreading a powerful message and we do our best to help them out, give them some feedback in the comments over on their channel and just review it for them as well as learn some things for our own channels as we look at what other people are doing here together. Today, I want to introduce you guys to this channel called Fight For Together and I wanted to review them because look how fast they're growing over here at Social Blade we see like boom <laughs> you know they're going up they currently have 821 subscribers and they're on par to break a thousand here in the next two weeks actually in two weeks from today according to Social Blade so we got to get this review in here uh, now now full disclosure these guys are friends of mine and my family and this guy actually used to be my boss, believe it or not, or, or one of them. Uh, I used to work at his company and now I don't, but now we get to hang out and uh, more as peers, which is, this is awesome. So they just started vlogging not too long ago and they made some substantial headway already up to 821 subscribers and we'll look at some of the things that they did well that got them to that point and then let's look at four things that they could do to improve. Number one is that they're following a really good best practice which is to have your posting schedule very clear and visible. You can see here they have it right in their header image. New vlog episodes every weekday. So if you subscribe to this channel, you know exactly when to come back and look for new content and you know what it's going to do, your subscription feed, things like that. They are, they're very clear about that in their videos and, and everywhere else. So that is really good. Number two is that they actually stick to that schedule and they're very consistent. So not only do they say they're going to do it, but they actually do it, which you'd be surprised how many channels I review who don't get those two things down. Either they're, they're not communicating it or they are and they're not sticking to it. Another th a third thing that these guys do really well that we, a lot of us can really learn from is they are very real, very authentic, very raw in their videos. These are relationships. These are also relationships. These are YouTube comments. These, these likes, these uh, comments, these followers on Instagram, these are relationships. But we all have to decide which relationships matter the most. Which are we the most called to? How should we spend our time? And, and it was really like this graphic thing of I had the baby right here or I can look at the screen. The kinds of things they talk about in their family vlogs are things that almost all families can relate to. Struggling relationships, raising children, marriage, sex, and lots of things they talk very candidly about in ways that are really helpful for any family. They also do one other thing really well that I don't see a lot of people doing that I think we could all learn from. And look at this right here. Get email updates. boss. <laughs> Get email updates. So what you can do, and they also have it in the description of each of their videos is you can click here and if you're not like a normal like YouTube subscriber but you want to follow their story you get email updates look you can just subscribe to their list right here now you can do that straight from your YouTube script subscriptions and just have YouTube send you an email notification. But a lot of people don't know how to do that. And even those who do don't really take advantage of it. And so I think that's a good way. They have it in the description of all their other videos down here too. So you get email updates. So I think that was, I think that's, that's pretty smart. And I'll add in a quick fifth bonus one here too. This video, their channel trailer, it's a little bit long at four minutes and four and a half minutes, but it's called Why We Fight For Together. And I think as a perfect way to, to introduce people to your channel is not just to tell them what we do. Hey, we're another family vlogger as if there's not enough of those out in the world, right? Instead, they're telling you this is why we fight for together and this is what we're all about. Fight for together is struggling to connect deeper with the ones that matter the most to you, actually putting up a fight to really connect. And it's not just what we do, but it's why it matters. And that is really, it's far more compelling than telling people just what you do. Hey, I'm a gamer. Hey, I'm a beauty vlogger. But if you tell them this is why we're doing what we're our channel, this is what we're about, this is our mission, that is really compelling. And a lot of people really, even if they don't really care what you're doing, maybe they don't normally follow family vloggers, but they'll follow you because they understand your mission and they believe in that with you. Really, really good, really important. Let's talk about four things that they could 
could use uh, for for doing a little bit better here. Okay, number one, titles when you're telling narratives, and we've talked more about this also in a previous channel review we, that we did, but uh, some of these titles could pro probably be a little bit stronger. Your titles and your thumbnails, and that kind of goes into the second thing, but um, the thumbnails, but the titles always need to tease a story. Uh, now, some of these kind of do. I would argue that Ghetto Swimming Pool doesn't really tease a story. New Neighbors doesn't really tease a story. When a Pet Dies kind of does. New Glasses for Eden kind of does. Eden is their daughter. Silver Candlesticks doesn't, you know, uh, we tried to go out. So I think there's a, a lot of room for thinking through what's the story that we're telling here in this video. And let's design the thumbnail and the title around around that uh, number two sometimes they stop doing this but uh, which is good but you can see that sometimes their text is kind of covering up the action on on their thumbnails right how how you have how many kids you know safety first this would probably be a more enticing video that would perform really well in related videos if this text was removed and safety first was the title because that is kind of a, a teasing you know uh, title when combined with this thumbnail which looks like her holding a knife but the knife is super small and is down here you know so if that was like a close-up thumbnail of the action and safety first that would probably tease a story that would entice a lot more people to watch and like here if covers up you know stuff like that but they've started going more of the visual route, which I think is good, but I still think there's probably room for them, like Silver Candlesticks. If that's the title, this should be closer up of the Silver Candlesticks, right? Uh, number three is going back to here, their branding. The fist bump is cool. I like it. It does, I don't know how tightly it connects to Fight For Together, right? So if I'm coming to their channel for the first time, maybe I saw one of their videos, I'm like, okay, these guys are cool. What else do they got here? And I'm coming. The header image is going to pitch their channel's value really, really quickly. And fight for together, the fist bump doesn't quite tell me what fight for together means. On the Look at the, this right here. Fight for together! <laughs> I wonder like a, a visual of like the whole family hugging each other really tight with some sort of visual of there being some sort of like opposition or something trying to pull them apart maybe or something like the family like we're gonna fight to be together and to work together to serve together to play together to everything together you know learn grow everything together um like that might be a better visual for the header image that would communicate more about their mission on their channel uh, a little more quickly than fist bump and then finally number four and this is something i see a lot of youtube creators do especially in vlogging world is uh let's just pick you know, let's go to the latest video it doesn't really matter okay so the the descriptions are really short all right, so they, they have this, which is good. We're the Crawford family. We post vlogs every weekday, inspiring people to connect deeper with the ones that matter the most. So that's really good. That's kind of like a, a summary of their mission. You guys should all be putting that in the descriptions of your videos also, in case they don't go to your channel. They just look into your description and they're like, oh, a little enticing thing there, right? And they got a couple other videos they're suggesting. But this is kind of default text they're adding everywhere. I would recommend at least writing like two or three, maybe even four sentences. Google's asking you for information about the video, so give them some information about that video so they know a little bit better when you first publish it, how to position it in search and related videos and things like that. Uh, and then this episode filmed on, like that's cool, you can have that, but I would push it down a little bit. So there are a link to their channels in the description below. You guys can totally go down there, check them out, leave feedback for them on their channel, leave feedback for them here, tell them what you like, what they're doing awesome. I, I love these guys. They're great friends of, of, of my family. And in fact, I'm starting a new project with Ben unrelated to YouTube, but I think a lot of you guys will be interested in as a podcast thing we're talking about. But I'll tell you guys more about that later. So go check them out. Link down there in the description below. And if this is your first time here on our channel, we'd love to have you subscribe here because we're all about helping you guys spread messages like the, just like the Crawfords are on Fight for Together about like messages that really impact and change lives. We are all about doing that here on this channel. And we want to help you guys do that. So subscribe. we got more channel reviews coming up. We've got stuff to help you grow the business side of your YouTube channel, money, all that kind of thing. So thanks for hanging out with guys you guys are awesome and i'll see you guys again next week for another youtube channel review see you then bye